Hi, my name's Ben. I'm here in Lynch plant today, installing a GKD sensor safe telehandler system. Uh, the idea of the system is that it will functionally limit the machine's capability to go through any uh, inputted height limit that's uh, been set on the machine so there's no damage to infrastructure or other machinery in an area. The system is quite self-explanatory. It starts uh, with the GKD logo. Uh, there's a couple of different settings you can use with a key switch. Uh, first of all, we'll go into a system where we can either set limits or we can override. So the system's quite self-explanatory to use. From a start point of view, as we showed before, you're going from the GKD, you can functionally choose between overriding the system and using it as it was intended from JCB, or you can set a workable limit uh, with two methods. So we'll select the override. Literally, the machine is now in a position where she can functionally power up and power down without the restriction of the GKD and she'll work all day in this position. Come away from there, we come out to the start screen. When we go in again, we can physically come in and set a height limit. The machine asks you to raise it, raise your arm to a position where you're happy for it to work. So this can be set with, a, with an engineer or a staff or you can preset a preset value we're going to go from a position where we're just going to manually set the limit. So literally one click, the machine tells us we're at 3.26 meters. So we need to adjust the key switch fitted just out of your line of sight to an operational mode. Now the machine is in, in a lock mode. You have no function here about a lifting up. You can come away from the limit. You can watch the limit decrease on a bar in the center of the screen. Very easy to see very functional to use and you can watch your height climb down. You're able to, once you come away, you can watch the arm come back up, watch your value climb and then get to a point where she's going to stop. This will always stop you early to err on the side of caution and then she'll let you come back through. This is so that you can't overachieve the limit set. We'll come back out of that for a minute. We're going to go back to the set limits. What we can do is we can Go to set a limit, I'm going to set a height limit and we'll manually enter a figure. So for this, for this next limit we'll set a 5 metre limit. Okay. Flip the machine into an operational mode and she's now ready. We can now functionally lift the arm, watch her climb, we can watch the figures on the screen climb. Watch as she's coming up. So as you can see, before we've got to the limit, she's got to a point where we're getting close to a limit, so she functionally cuts. She's then gonna allow us to go a little bit more. So we're coming up to our window. There's a 500 mil window from where you're set, so you can't overachieve if you're traveling at speed. The idea of the system is to make it as easy as possible to functionally have a height limiting system on the machine without interrupting the use of the machine. So as we've demonstrated, really easy to power the machine up and down and functionally um, add and remove limits and work within a preset environment so you've no danger to infrastructure or other machines or human life uh, and the machine can then carry on and work nice and easy.